In this tutorial, we will look at how to use Immersive Reader while using Minecraft Education. So here, here I am in a Minecraft world, and as I'm navigating the world, if I come across a sign or another object with text on it, I can then get close enough to activate Immersive Reader. And you'll notice over here on the left corner that I have my control keys. And one of the keys, it shows me the key I, will bring up Immersive Reader. So I'm going to press I on my keyboard. And here we go. Immersive Reader loads. Everything is stripped away. And I can now break down this text with my usual settings of text preferences where I can adjust the size of the text. I can increase or decrease spacing. I can change the font type. And I can change the color contrast. All right, I can also go to my grammar options where I might want to look at my syllables or look for the nouns and verbs, etc. And finally, I can go into my reading preferences where I can turn on line focus or I can utilize the picture dictionary. Picture dictionary. And Education. I can also translate the text to a language of my choice. And I can translate the whole document. And there it is. I can also go back to the English original language and back to the translated language. I can even have this played back for me in both languages. Bienvenido a Minecraft, Educación y Dicen. Este tutorial te enseñará controles. And I have voice settings as well where I can speed up or slow down the voice and I can choose between male and female voices. Controles, artesanía e interacciones básicas dentro del mundo de Minecraft. All right, and that is Immersive Reader. When I'm done using this and I now understand the message, I can click the large arrow here to back out of Immersive Reader. And now I'm back in Minecraft Education Edition where I can move on. Now, one other place you can use Immersive Reader is when you are talking to NPCs or non-player characters. When you approach an NPC, as you know, you can right click to talk to this person. Here is now the message from this person that pops up. And as you can see in the bottom right corner, we have the immersive reader icon. And so I can click here to bring up the text and utilize my immersive reader tools to digest this text. Once the hot bar is full, items will be stored in the in and that is how you use Immersive Reader in Minecraft Education Edition.